I see sports? Sure. Do sunny side up, Cheryl, please. Hey, Daniel, can you get that? You better put some steam into it, Sammy. I always make it. Look at that. Tax on unemployment. What do you got to worry about? Juan has got nothing to worry about. Everybody knows the foreign got the hot spray air. I'll pay attention about what you said, Annie. Just kidding. Just don't be late, boy. Get out of here. Look at that. Now that's art, Sammy. Polishing the boss's ass. Last hired, first fired. You ain't kidding. Hey, Sammy. Hey, hey, what do you say? Hey, I get that right, huh? What do you do? What do you say? What do you do comes first. What do you do? How are you doing anyway, Crash? Hey, Crash, it doesn't matter. You stay out of trouble today? Oh, yeah, well, it, it was uh, it was a big addition today, and there was a lot of houses I did. Hey, you know what tomorrow is? What's tomorrow? Collection day. Well, I got to collect all the money. Well, well, my mom helps me add it up. Not bad. Oh. Hey, you know what else I heard? No. What else? Hey, Crash, when did you start wearing this oh, hat? Man, just leave the hat alone. <laughs> funny hey, hat. you know what else I heard? What? You know what they got coming to the star? No, what's coming to the star? You mean no one told you? No one told me what's coming to the star. Naked women. Naked women? Oh, you mean strippers? Well, naked women. Well, they take all their clothes off. Do it to music. Hey, you want to go? No, I don't think so, Crash. You want to go? Well, I ain't never seen anything like that before. Well, then you ought to go. No, I, I couldn't. Hey, oh, Mom wouldn't let me. <laughs> well, they got naked women in Grand Rapids, Sammy? Yeah, it's nothing new. Huh. Hey, are you hungry, Sammy? You know it, kid. Let's go grab some food. <laughs> You're always hungry, I Sammy. Know, guys, I'm always... All right, it's supposed to snow. to bless me, Nick. How are you, Nick? Just fine, Mrs. Allison. And you? Oh, just fine. Just fine. Dana, put a burger up for Mrs. Allison. I did when she came in. I do not want her hanging around here. The good Lord will strike you down, Anna Fletcher. Nick, I'm going downstairs. I want her out before I get back. Yes, ma'am. You'll perish, Anna Fletcher. Perish in the flames of hell. Now, Mrs. Allison, that isn't nice, is it? Dana, where's that burger? Coming up. Here you go, my lady. No onions, just the way you like it. Onions are the food of the devil, you know. Yes, indeed, Mrs. Allison. Bless you, Dana. Bless you, Nick. Uh, Nick, I wonder if I could just give you $2 today and then pay the rest on Friday when I get my paycheck? Sure, Wanda, I know you're good for it. You're so generous, Nick. Yeah, thanks, Nick. Nicholas, can I see you for a minute? Yes, sweetheart. What is it? Hi, Smith. We got no money, and you got to go around treating everybody. Times are hard. We got to look out for the customers we still got. Anyway, Wanda will pay it back. It's not Wanda's credit. I'm worried about it. 
Well, do you realize in the last half hour you've given away burgers, coffee, and I just don't know what to do with you. Now we gotta close early. Why? Well, you remember. La Traviata's on TV tonight. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Hey, don't worry about me, Cher. Remember, I've been running this place a long time, and I ain't let it go under yet, hmm? Yeah, Cheryl. Listen to me, old man. Dana, would it be asking too much for you to stay out of my personal conversations, hmm? Here's, here's Sammy and, and Cheryl. Well, why don't you just lie to me some more, huh, Sammy? Hey, Cheryl, Sammy says if I wear this hat, I'm gonna go bald. So what do you do? What do you say, Mrs. Fletcher? I'd like to treat you today. Oh, my back hurts me a bit. I hope you feel better. You want some pie, dear? Not just now, thanks. I better have dinner first. Hey, Cheryl, how's it going? I've almost finished the magus, Sammy. It's a little weird, but I think I like it. You two in your books. Hey, Dana, put up two luckies and fry. Hey, Crash, when are you going to take that hat off? <laughs> what, uh, did you get a haircut? Uh-uh, no way. <laughs> hey, Crash. How are you coming with the time trick I showed you? Oh, not so good, Dana. I, I don't know. I tried, but it's hard. I'll sweat, man. You'll get it. I'll sweat. Hey, Sammy, I've got to check the stock. Why don't you come with me and we can talk about the book? It'd be a pleasure, Sheila. You guys better get down there, huh? No. Eight boxes of straws. I am exhausted. You know, if you sold more stuff, you wouldn't have to count so much, sure. Ha ha. So, how'd you like the magus? Actually, Sammy, I wanted to talk to you about something else. I know, you finally realized we should run away to Mexico mm -hmm. together, am I right? Well, the warm weather would help my leg, but you're dreaming. Does your leg really bother you? No, it acts up a bit in the winter. So? What do you want to talk about? Nick. Something wrong between you two? Sure doesn't seem like it. Well, it's not really Nick, it's a diner. Don't you like working in the diner? I do. It's just the problem. Well, it's not the diner either. It's a stupid painter. Oh, wait a minute, Cheryl. It's not Nick, and it's not the diner, and it's some painters. I don't follow you. It's just that before we got married, I never asked Nick about finances or anything. You know, I figured that he'd been running the diner long enough, and, and then we had to go and get the damn place painted, and we had to take out that loan, and, and then Anna kept ignoring the bills, and she keeps dipping into the register anyway for booze, and, and then they wanted to haul us into court, Wait and I just who don't know... To, who wants to haul you into court? Stupid painters. We don't have the money. I, I don't see what good suing us is going to do them. I mean, it's a lot of money, and we can't borrow from the bank anymore, you know? My Aunt Frieda always said, neither a borrower nor a lender be. How much do you owe? It's a lot of money, Sammy. How much? 400 $400? Christ, sure. I could loan you that. You, you can't go telling everybody about it. It's not like I'm rolling in dough, but I can loan you that much. You could? <laughs> you mean you can? Yeah. I can't believe it, Sammy. Can you really? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you say we go tell Nick? Let's tell Nick later, okay, sure. Piece of news for you this morning. We're laying you off. For how long? We're laying you off permanent. I got word from up top. We gotta lay you off. Well, what did I do? Look, at times being what they are, Hollander, I'm sorry, but you gotta go. You're out, Hollander. That's all there is to it. Out, out, don't you understand? O U T, out. You're fired. Well, thanks a lot. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks Anytime. a lot. My pleasure.
hey, Sammy, you wasn't there. I know, Crash. Come on. Well, where were you? I waited. I know, Crash. I'm sorry. Come on, let's go. Go where? Go cruising, Crash. Come on, let's go. Cruising? Yeah, cruising. Come on. Two Lucky Burgers, water, cheeseburger, fries, root beer, float. Two Lucky Burgers, fries, float, split a vanilla shake, and two fries, huh? Yeah. I guess so. That sounds right. I don't know I got what I got. Yeah, that sounds right. I don't know if it went along. got to tell you that story about that that Halloween night that you had the power failure and the trick or treaters came by. Yes. Tell me that story. That was great. Sounds good. Come here, come here, come here. Look at Sammy's accident. Is everybody okay? Nothing. Just ran into a parked mailbox. Crazy kid. Sam, you're drunk. Let me get you some coffee. Oh, very generous of you, Cheryl. Oh, can it. The side's pretty smashed up. Yeah, but the engine's okay. I can fix it. Do it at the shop? No. Hey, Nick, he was teaching me to make an omelet. Can you show me? I guess so, Crash. Everybody okay, huh? Yeah. What happened to you, young man? Oh, Christ, Mrs. Fletcher, it's nothing, Nick. You're always hungry. I got canned. Oh, Sammy, I'm so sorry. What? He got canned? Yeah, Mommy got fired. And why would they fire yeah, a nice boy yeah. like you? Not from around here, no prior. Um, just we'll blend when you come. Hey, Sammy, since you're a free man now, what do you say we go to Hidden Lake tomorrow? Would you like that? Yeah, I guess so, Sheriff. Hey, Nick, can we take a few hours off and go to Hidden Lake tomorrow? 
Sure, sure, sure. I don't see why not. Good. We'll have a great time. Sure, sure. Okay. I don't see why not. What you yeah, need is a nice piece of my yeah, famous yeah. blueberry pie. <laughs> Goodness knows you could stand to have something on your stomach. Ah, uh, don't go to any bother, Mrs. Fletcher. Oh, it's no bother at all, Sammy. No, I'll just go downstairs right. and bring one up. Yeah, okay. and she's taking a little nip, too. Glug, glug, glug. <laughs> Ma, you all right? Ma? Oh, my God, she fell. Wait, Cher, call an ambulance. Jesus! Six months, if she heals well. Broken knees are pretty serious, Cher. Yeah, tell me about it. Listen, Nick, I was only in a wheelchair for a month. I was pretty lucky in that way, but... But Anna's lucky, too. She could have been her I didn't worst. even want to think about it. Well, that's all there is to it, then. We'll have to close. Close the diner? You can't be serious. Well, so we'll stay open and pay our medical bills. With what? Lucky burgers? How about your Uncle Philip or, or Lou Corby? No. See what you mean. Can't ask Sammy now. Sammy doesn't have that much money anyway. Well, he said he'd got some saved up, but well, he couldn't pay the whole thing, but it would help out. <sighs> We'd sell my clarinet. That we're not doing. We're people first. The diner comes second. We'll think of something. Besides, how would I get up in the morning without that thing squeaking? My clarinet doesn't squeak. I squeak. Besides, have you heard your singing voice lately? Anyway, I think we should ask Sammy. Well, it can't hurt to ask. We've got to try something. Oh, Sammy, you know, I don't think I can get Anna and the diner off my mind. I thought this would help, but... Well, you know, that $400 you lent us really... You know, it saved us. You know, if we don't get like a couple hundred dollars more, we're gonna be in big trouble, Sammy. I, I know that you just lost a job and everything, but, but, like you were saying that you had some saved up. No, and I was Cheryl, wondering, I absolutely can't. You, Sammy, we'd be good for it by summer. I know, but I need it now. You don't need all of it, do you? Look. possibilities around here this morning and there's nothing. Nothing. I mean, I may be out of work for a long time. But we could give you all your meals free. Sammy, the diner's going to close otherwise. Free meals are a nice touch, Cheryl, but what am I going to do about a roof over my head? You could stay in our basement. You're getting ridiculous, Cheryl. How cozy, just you, me, and Nick. What's that supposed to mean? You know damn well. Look, we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't gotten drunk. Don't try to pin it on me. It's true. She was going downstairs after your piece of pie. She was going down to get drunk, and if you guys took better care of her. Look, I'm sorry.
want to help your friends out? Come on, but that's not fair. Oh, hey, geez. Sammy. Hey, Cheryl. Are you guys hungry? Hey, what do you do? What do you say, huh? Sure, I'm hungry. Let's go. Now, that's a good idea. I've been out here freezing and trying to keep crashing blind. Hey. You said no, Nikki. Cheryl. Hey, no need for apologies. It's your money. What oh, money? What are you guys talking about? Nothing, honey. Come on, why don't you walk me to the park? I know it was ridiculous. Look, Nick, I... everybody's got their own problem. Come on, let's go back to the car. You guys go ahead. I'll go back to the Hey, Sam, are you hungry? She heard my Why? I want to go to the diner. There's some cold beans in the fridge, Crash. Eat that. But I don't want any cold beans. I want a lucky burger. Nah, Crash, why don't you just eat it? Because you don't got anything good to eat here. I want a lucky burger. And some fries. And chocolate milk. And a piece of pie. Cool and maybe some. We'll, we'll talk about it after the game, okay? Okay. Hey, Sam. Can we play a different game? Sure, Crash, I guess so. Well, you gotta give me all your cards. Oh, well, it's a special game. It's something that Dana taught me. It's got a special deal. Okay. What's it called, Cross? 52 card pickup! <laughs> You're so stupid, Sally! <laughs> okay, Crash. Let's go to the back. Well, you're not mad, huh? Mm -hmm. Been pretty busy. So how's it going? Not too good. Doesn't seem like there's any work around here. So what do you think you'll do? I don't know. I guess I'll be pushing off. Well, what's pushing off, Sammy? Leaving, splitting, saying bye-bye. Well, then you're going back to Grand Rapids? I don't know. I may be moving on. Will you be close enough to... Is it, Sam? I don't know, Cheryl. Mm. How, how's things going with this place? Not so good here, either. We got another bank loan, but the place is mortgaged now, and I don't know how we're going to keep up on the payments. vane has been great, though. He's been working extra hours to help out, and we're going to owe him the back pay. My Aunt Frida turn over in her grave. Just goes on and on, doesn't it? Surely does. So, what do you want, Crash? Well, I want a Lucky Burger and some fries and a chocolate milk and uh, what kind of pie you got this week? Lemon. Lemon. Mm. Oh, the double banana split. Hey, Crash, where are you gonna put all that food? Well, right here. Hey, Cheryl, Sammy was going to make me cold beans. Cold beans, yeah. <laughs> That's all I had in the house. You two give me a break, huh? 
what do you want, chili? God, anything but beans. <laughs> uh, lucky burger and a coke. No fries. Nah, better not. Don't worry about it. I'll get you some fries. Thanks, Cheryl. Hey, Cheryl, you you read Women in Love yet? Yeah, I just about finished it. Good. Maybe uh, we can talk about it when you're done. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I've been spending more time with my clarinet lately. I, I didn't like Women in Love too much. Lawrence just isn't real, you know. It, it, he's always talking about... Forests and trees and they. Oh, you two in your books. You don't like our books? <laughs> yeah. Well, I tell you what, Crash, uh, let's talk about your comic books. I don't know, Crash. You guys are coming in the I'm hanging around you. <laughs>